What? Okay, my timer's fucking up, D-Class. Give me a moment. Let me fix that. Timer! So, let me fix this. Obviously, it's fucking up. It's not 33 hours. Don't know why it's at that. Boom. Add time. Wait, set timer to that. Okay, since you're not wanting to cooperate, we'll do it this way. Damn piece of crap. Oh wait, I chose the wrong one. I chose window instead of browser. God damn it. Okay. Uh the worst browser, worst browser. There it is. Ignore that. It's not 33 hours. refresh the marathon timer website I think that website's fucked up yes fucking pain in the ass Thank you! God damn. Pain of my existence. Oops, did not mean to do that. Get Eris to level 55 and take down the bitch. The fighting type bitch. And I'll be in. End of Team Star. God damn it. Okay. 
Yeah, you can't escape me, bitch. You will. Your blood will be spread upon these lands. Man, so many Lux Rays. Which is good, because they gave a lot of experience. <laughs> Damn it, I thought I could jump over the mall. Another Lux Ray. Kill. Ursary and kill them as well. Oh shit. I can heal, unlike you. That does not affect me. Your scary face does not affect me whatsoever. I will still murder you and heal. He just murder you. Oh wow, good. More of you to murder. That gives a lot of experience. I like murder. I must cause murder. Ouch. That hurt. Uh oh. I may be at a disadvantage. Yes. Heal, Grand Inferno.
<laughs> yeah, I'm gonna heal Grand Inferno after this. Defiant! <laughs> Damage you've done is being healed. Must murder this bishop. You know, my I forgot to tweet. I mean, I'm a Perfectly amazing streamer. That tweet's been back. I can now go back to murdering. Oh, god damn it. I forgot to heal. God damn it. Fucking cricket bitch. None of you can catch up to me now. I am much faster than the likes of you. Just, just playing the piano. That's all. There's nothing wrong with playing the piano. And now this guy will immediately be murdered by the crocodile. <laughs> yes, this Luxray must die. Love murdering. 
Murdering is fun. Pokemon's having issues. <laughs> I'm about to murder the parent of these children. And there's nothing they can do about it. to get your ass kicked. And <laughs> now credit for us all 79. <laughs> Where's the Luxray when you need one? Speaking of Luxray... Oh, god damn it! No, I didn't want to kill an orphan. That's for later. I wanted to kill an orphan's parent. <laughs> Pokemon Garter Force ready. So uh, then I'll just heal up all my Pokemon and take down that fighting gym bitch. Oh, why did I use Shadow Ball? What a fucking moron. I was supposed to burn him to a crisp. I'm an idiot. Yes. Looks like it will be a berry. Yeah. 
Yes. All Pokemon of mine will be moved. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, I need to give items back. Or does it just have ground? I actually don't think anyone has. Now, I will give this guard shop. So, yeah, I don't think I have any. Get the Pokemon. Bet to you. Good to you. Get that to you. So fuck that. No one's falling asleep. I'm lazy to go there myself. I'm too lazy. Just, I'm just riding over there. I'm just gonna fly. So yeah, Grand Inferno is ready to take down this motherfucker. Yeah, I'll well, beat the shit out of this boss again. Nothing you can do about it. We already heard our forest line, so we don't need to hear him again. I'm about to whoop your ass. Yeah, it's super effective, but it doesn't do much. <laughs> now watch how much damage I do. <laughs> Just one shot. Fuck you. And now I'm slowly gonna heal the damage you did. Fuck it, I'll, I'll switch it out for him. Yeah, I can switch out for him and use Dig. How is fighting super effective against Lucario? One shot, bitch. <laughs> okay, so he's ghost. I 
I'll switch out you. Yeah, get crunch. Yeah, bitch. Oh, I thought Crunch would be good against him. Oh. Now I'm not so worried. Oh, yeah. That did, that did damage. That, that did good damage. Oh, that did bad amount of damage. Yeah, but, um. <clears throat> Goodbye, Annihilate. The one bitch I hate the most. Oh, fuck, that did damage. That did a lot of damage. All right, Bramblegast, I believe in you to at least hit him. Yes, your speed stats awesome, Bramblegast. Yeah, fuck you, Annihilate. No longer seeing any more of you, bitch. I'll switch off the guard chomp. If I think it's the right one I'm thinking of. No, it wasn't. <laughs> I was thinking of Persian. Can it me now, bitch? Ooh, that did. Oof, that hurt. But I did a decent amount of damage. And bye bye. And I'm going down. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'm... You won't see me. I, you can't hurt me, bitch. Oh. Haha. <laughs> Uh, it, you're, all you're doing is just ramping up your speed. But I mean, if I keep avoiding your attacks, that's not gonna help you. Oh, fuck you. You're just gonna keep doing it so you one-shot everyone. Fuck you. On. That's not fair. Ha, ah, your speed won't go any higher. Hi, ah, can't hurt me now, bitch. Constantly keep using dig. Uh oh. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. 
happen. I, I, the only thing is I have to hope and pray that Garfor doesn't get one shot it. Psychic, so I can superpower psychic. Please go first, Eris. Scarchomp did their best to knock them down for you. I mean, Lemon, not Garchomp. Why are I keep saying Garchomp? Okay. We're good. Prepare to die, motherfucker. And you're gone. <laughs> One shot it, bitch. I am so sorry, everyone. I'm sorry. I think I went a little too far. Nah, don't worry about it. We're the ones who actually put us through some tough battle practice so we can train up. Yeah, but... Truly, you do not need to apologize, my lady. Thanks to thy sage instruction, I'm making swift strides towards mastering the art of battle. And I can never have evolved my Pokemon without you, Aerie. Even a big boss says it's thanks to you that we have a fighting chance against our bullies. See, nothing but gratitude to us. You're the brightest star in the whole team. <laughs> Come on, quit being silly. Just one thing. We've been training for four whole hours now. I am totally pooped. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. You all really should take a break. I'll go for a run while you rest up. My lady, we, we four have trained in our turn, but free, but you, our steadfast mentor, have rested not once. I cannot help but worry for thy health. Thank you for your concern, Atticus. But lately, I feel like I can take anything, even if I'm if I'm really tired or feel like crying. Remember that time we all got together and rifled it on the gym badges designs to create our very own star badges? Well, I don't know what it is, but just looking at my star badge makes me feel so strong. Like I want to give it my all. I gave it my all, but it wasn't enough. I wasn't enough. You showed amazing strength. Even if the code didn't require me to give it to you, I want you to have it. Oh, that's cute. <coughs> oh, my throat hurts. I see thigh out. My trademark move too. Here, this one's for you. Ooh, that actually is a good move. But it also lowers defense, and I don't like that, so I'm not going to give it the Garchomp. I know you're a part of Operation Starfall, but I can tell from our battle that you're not a bad person. The way your Pokemon look at you with such trust gives it away. Do me a favor and look away for a moment. This is a bit much for me to take. I just really, really... And she went to cry. Looks like it's all over. Oh, Riri. This is Team, so uh, team Star me member. You battled at the gates earlier. I asked her to come along for a talk. So what did you want to ask me? 
seemed to be much friendlier in terms of Airy compared to the other grunts. Why is that? Oh, you spotted that? Well, alright, I don't mind telling you. Truth is, I used to hate Riri. She's an amazing trainer and athlete, and she's really pretty too. It took her no time at all to become popular at the Academy. I was the queen of the class before she came along. But then everyone liked her more than me. So let me guess. You started to pick on her. Pretty much. I got our classmates to join in too. We were all so stupid. But in the end, kids are always fickle. And once one thrill wears off, they look for something new. Before long, the class chose me as their next target and started bullying me instead. I guess I deserved it, but then... Riri, she chose to help me, even though I've been so horrible to her. She told me that she understood how hard it is to have no one on your side. She invited me into Team Star. Even after you bullied her like that? What a kind girl. She really is, and joining the team has worked out, out great for us. It's been so much fun. Fun? There are rumors that Team Star likewise engages in bullying. If they hear my story, do you really think that's true? Uh, no. I merely... Maybe the rest of Team Star made me who I am today. Please don't take away our greatest treasure. Alright, so all that's left is take down the team leader. Aaron Wright, it's me. Did you do it? Did you claim Aerie's star badge? Without its boss, the Saf Squad should be at hair's breadth from disbanding. So Aerie was the last. All five squad bosses have been toppled from their pedestals. I imagine they'll leave Team Star before long now that they've lost their special positions. After that, they should be back attending classes at the Academy. Nice work out there, Aaron. Is that Clive I hear? <laughs> Sorry. Cannoli, well done to you too. Thanks. Now about your reward, Aaron. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone. As promised. Holy shit, I have 200,000 LP. Where did that come from? Oh, that reminds me. I'm doing a whole supply unit rep thing this time, right? Indeed, you can go ahead and give Erin her bonus reward now. At long last, Operation Starfall has entered its final stage. There's only one thing left on the agenda. You must defeat the big boss and have Team Star disband for good. Where's the big boss? Don't worry, there's no need to search them out. The true identity of the big boss is none other than me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to keep it from you for so long. The right moment never came. I know one who formed Team Star back then, and the members of the team of the team were my closest friends. And I treasure them more than anything. They go on like this, Team Star won't do any good for anyone. They've got to give up, give it up. So I'm using the code we made together to force them to disband. Aaron, I've been waiting for you in the schoolyard after dark. You should come as well, Clive. Understood. Then I'll see you both there. So... Canole was the big boss of Team Star this whole time. 
I scarcely thought it possible. But with this revelation, I just might have an inkling as to their true identity. It seems we'll find our answers after dark in the Academy schoolyard. Let's prepare as best we can before heading over. So I'm gonna go ahead and heal and see what TMs I can make. If I can make Earthquake, I'm gonna try my hardest to get it to that way so Garchomp can have it. Cause I mean Lemon can have it. Cause Lemon needs Earthquake. But yeah, I only lost two Pokemon that time. That was not that bad. Especially <laughs> with Grand Inferno being at level 79. <laughs> Grand Inferno just like one shotted two Pokemon. <laughs> Alright, let's see what new shit I got. It's probably not gonna be down. Near the bottom, though. Dragon Tail, that's new. Then a shock, that's also really good. But no. Got better poison type moves than that. Dig. Send head, but that's also really good. But no. Oh, hi, Dragon. Hello. I, de I defeated uh, the fighting type uh, person. Oh. I decided, yeah. to see, uh, I decided. you know what? Let's just have Grand Inferno be in the front. Mm -hmm. They're weak to fighting. They're going to get hurt badly. Grand Inferno is a ghost type. Yeah, but he's also weak to fighting. Like, he is super effective. Fighting what... a normal? Wait. I don't... I thought Ghost going to be hit by fighting or normal type. Well, it said it's super effective when it hit me, but it only right. took like 20 points of health. And when I used Flamethrower, it, it one-shotted them. I was like, well, mm -hmm. this is a power of level 79. Oh, wait, was it the spin-out move? Because the spin-out move is a steel type move, and I think... No, I think That's they weird. used like... Br uh, yeah, they used close combat. Huh? Well, it hit. Uh, don't question it. That shouldn't. That what? Yeah, ghost types have a total immunity to normal and fighting. That what? Well, maybe the fire typing it kicked in. No, because they, they would still be affected by the ghost types, and the ghost types have total immunity. Not only that, fire isn't weak against fighting. Well, I don't know what to tell you, Dragon. It, it says super effective. <laughs> you got fucked over by the game. Yeah. Well, time to redo an hour of making totally ethical apples. Ooh. Aura Sphere. What? Definitely gonna need to get that move before. Wait, I can't teach Aura Sphere to go... Okay. I could have sworn you could have taught Forest Spear to Garchomp. No, you can't. Why is my Snow Golem decapitated? No, go, go back. There's yeah. only one move I really need to give uh, Lemon, which mm -hmm. is Earthquake. Oh, yeah, Earthquake's really fucking good. I have a plan. Okay. I have a plan. I need to- God, my desk is a mess. If I- uh, Since my art tablet is more of like a second a screen sometimes, I'm going to use my f actual monitor for Pokemon and my second screen for whatever else. Damn. I think our trouble will learn Earthquake at level 65, though. So I don't need the rush. Yeah. Oh shit! Okay, mm -hmm. I'm giving this to Garchomp. Lemon, I mean. 
Um, Lemon can learn Thunder Fang. Oh, that's really good. Yeah. <laughs> I did not know they could do that. Lemon. Ow. Oh. I can't believe Sonic the Hedgehog died by eating a lemon. Or was it Shadow? I think it was Sonic. It was Sonic the Hedgehog. He fucking exploded. Oh my god. Wait, what? what? Lemon can learn liquidation? Yeah. You know what, to be honest, I'll, I'll give... Is there anything Dragon is strong against? Uh, one moment. Dragon's strong against Dragon. I want to get rid of Crunch because Liquidation does five more attack power. Uh... And I already have a bunch of Dark type moves on other team members, so I don't need another one. I'm pretty sure Dragon is only good against Dragon. That's not, that can't be. That can't. Well, now my team is probably overpowered thanks to Grand Inferno. <laughs> Who just basically goes around one-shotting everything. Weird. They're only saying it's strong against Dragon, but I'm pretty sure that's wrong. Wait a minute, there's actually... Oh wait, I was about to say there was two areas where it had that weird thing where... Well, I'm about to take on... You said that they're easy, right? Uh, yeah. Alright, well, that's... Well, I mean, it's probably gonna be easier for me, because you probably didn't have a level 79 Grand Inferno. <laughs> <laughs> Grand Inferno's just gonna walk up and burn a bitch. <laughs> Okay, here we go. It's about to happen. Sup, Aaron? Five? Yep, that's my name. Actually, no, it's time to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. <laughs> yeah, I knew the entire time, you dumb fuck. Do apologize for deceiving you with my disguise. In truth, the boy you knew as Clive was none other than the director of Yuva Academy. Dr. Mr. Clavel, a clavicle. <laughs> yes, it must be quite the shock. My disguise was perfect after all. No, it wasn't. Regardless, there is still one more astonishing truth I must reveal to you. The true identity of Cannoli, the big boss of Team Star, was me all along. For real? Honest to goodness. We heard Cannoli over the phone. That was actually a pre-recorded voice. I pulled it off using, er, you know, one of those high-tech gizmos. Oh yes, it was very clever. So, Miss Aaron, now you know I'm the big boss. That means there's only one thing left to do. Face me in one final showdown to decide it all. Huh. I That's not what I was expecting. I thought it would be Penny. Yeah. But old man knows how technology works. Oh god, you have to face against the goddamn monkey that keeps spamming yawn. <laughs> it is incredibly tanky. Uh, oh, it didn't- what? 
I also gave uh, Grand Inferno leftovers. So basically, I just made Grand Inferno overpowered. Because <laughs> they can oh, constantly if you wanna heal. Make, if you want to make Flamethrower overpowered, uh, you can buy from one of the deli bird shops on the, that show up on the map. Uh, you can actually get a piece of charcoal and you can give it to him and it'll make his power fire type moves more powerful. Uh, Poltergeist, uh, switch Pokemon. So yeah, Gardevoir. <laughs> yep. Look, is it Psychic or Fairy that Ghost is not good against? Uh... I forgot. I know Dark Type's good against, uh, Fairy Types. Not Fairy oh, Types. Oh, it's no. all effective, so none of them. Yeah, Dark Type's what you use against Ghosts. But Ghost is also good against Ghosts, so... Alright. Well, not in this case. It's that effective. Mm -hmm. So we're sitting out in. And I just made her attack weaker. Wow. Yeah, that that that, that didn't do much, but. Yeah, I'm just fucking clavicle up. Weak armor defense fell. <laughs> You're just making yourself weaker. Why are you doing that? Who knows? Well, it does raise its attack. Yeah. And you are on fire. How do you light a giant fucking scaly ass fish on fire? You don't know. You'll never know. Oh, Jesus. Okay. That wasn't good. Uh... Grand Inferno, I believe in you. I just hope your speed stat is higher. Fuck! Oh! Grand Inferno hang in there! Hey, hung in there! Yes! <laughs> Fuck you! Oh, Grand Inferno hung in there like a champ. Hound Doom. Oh, god damn it! Oh, wait. Wait! No, this will be even better. Ha sending out the chonk. Let chonk deploy. I just love the chonks so much, and I want a plushie of them. Oh, I, I, ha I 100% believe that they're going to make a plushie of Lechonk, uh, Lechonk and Lechonk. Like, that Earthquake. is a marketable boy. <laughs> yes. Suffer by my earthquake, bitch. <laughs> oh, actually, okay, so you know how that Hound Doom that you encounter at the start of the game? Where you have to be saved from it by the legendary, right? Am I yeah. right on? Did you know? So you know the locking on feature where you can, like, you. So you can actually see the hound door before you get attacked by it. It's standing over, like, a young goose, uh, and you can't, like, get it. But you can lock onto it. It's level 40. Oh, dear God. Yeah. I tried to throw a Pokeball at it, seeing if you could fight it. You could not. Yeah, I need to heal Grand Inferno first. Otherwise, they're gonna get either killed or really hurt. <laughs> you use a grass type move on a fire type. You are a dumbass. It's very possible that Obama Snow only knows fighting type moves. Flamethrower. <laughs> Just one shot. 
wait for it. <laughs> Heal! Amoongus. Oh, that's also a plant oh, yeah, type. that's not the one. The, the one after Amoongus, I think. Yeah, the one after Amoongus. Which means I'll send in the chonk. <laughs> Just one shot. So, you know about the, the little duck that you left at the start of the game that no one chose? Oh, okay, so I know exactly who to send in and this time then. I actually don't know what uh, type. I know there's still gonna be water. Yeah, it's water something. And now I can see the final evolution to this. What the fuck? <laughs> What's wrong, Bright? You don't like it? No. You don't like the sassy gay duck? Are they gonna turn- if they turn into water, that's just gonna make them extremely weak to the move I'm about to use. You dumb motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, if you couldn't tell, uh, my internet went out for a while. Uh-oh. Oh! Eris at three health! It didn't kill. Shit. Yeah, they're gonna hit first. Okay, fuck, I didn't set up the eggs properly, goddammit. Oh wait, I can just send in the chonk. They can't get hurt by water. <laughs> Why didn't I just send in the chonk? <laughs> Earthquake, bitch. Oh, of course you use ice spinner. Fuck you. Oh. Oh, chonky boy dead. No, chonky boy sad. Okay, Actually, okay, since you're planning on doing the entire Pokédex, uh... Uh, apparently, most of the starters from previous games are back, so that's fun. Uh, but I don't think they're a version exclusive. I, I think you can get all of them, thankfully. Jesus fuck, that would be annoying. Um, but, uh, you, okay, so you can- you know how you get a regular Wooper, right? You don't- you get the non-muddy version of Wooper? Yeah. You can actually evolve that, but the- uh, but it doesn't count on the Pokédex. So, yeah. You don't have to Shit. Come on, take it in. Oh, Bramble Guest! Let's oh, go. yes! Oh, you took it like a champ, Bramble Guest! What a good, what a good little dead thing. Oh, you. Good job, Bramble Guest. Oh, what a good lad. This is why we, you stay on the team. <laughs> That's right, bitch. He whooped your ass. I'm also gonna need to get items for everyone on the team. I mean, I got Guard Chomp's thing for like his brick break. He got, he's got the muscle band, which improves his physical type moves. Mm -hmm. So yeah. If you want to give items to all of your party members to improve their moves for specific typings, uh, so yeah. again, the deli store, you go to one of those, but they have different items, specifically like battle items. They have different items. Mm-hmm per store, so you have to check out different stores, but the one in the main city has, like, basic stuff that should be able to cover most of your team. Got it. <gasps> oh, shit. Well, M Miss Aaron Bright, it seems you have grown quite splendidly over the course of your treasure hunt. And here, once again, I must apologize. I'm, I am not actually cannoli. Though Clive and myself being the same person was no lie behind you. Cannoli's true identity remains hidden. But I believe I can hazard a guess as to who they may be. That is why I sought to spare you from having to confront them in battle. 
their sorrows should not be yours to bear. However, Cannoli has settled on a course of action and is determined to see it through. I do not imagine any ordinary student sh could hope to stand against them and win. So I challenged you to a battle to test your skill. If you had lost, it would have fallen to me to bring down Cannoli, such as was my resolve. But it turns out you are strong, as you are kind. If anyone has a chance of saving that poor child, it is surely you. As an educator, it shames me to burden one of my students with such a task. But please defeat Cannoli. Take on the big boss of Team Star and win. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart, I leave this in your hands. You there, what what do you think you're doing? Ah, Miss Time. A pleasure to see you. It's no pleasure at all, Miss Cla Clavicle. I came to investigate reports of an illicit battle on the school grounds, and what do I find? Why, the director of the academy himself, facing off against one of our students, no less. What were you thinking? Uh, no, if I could just explain. You see, it is a rather sad tale. Oh, spare me! Your excuse freaks worse than a stunk- than a st stunkies behind. A, st a stunkies b behind? Ahem. Remember the big boss access to meet them in the school yard after dark? I'm counting on you, Miss Aaron Bright. Alright. You'll write a letter of an apology to the students and faculty at once. And I'll be reporting this to the chairwoman of the school board. Make no mistake. Good gracious, no. A a anything but that, I implore you. God damn it. But we still have no idea who the fuck it was. I thought you, you looked it up. I could have lied. Well, now I gotta heal first. Cause my Pokemon got their ass. No, not. Well, some of them got their butts kicked. I really hope my alarm for getting eggs doesn't like. isn't going through my microphone because it is very loud. No. Okay, that's good. I'm also gonna need to buy. Yeah, I think. First thing I'm gonna need to do. is get items to improve power. And then, well, I'm also gonna need to get full restores. I got plenty of revives, I just need full restores. Damn, they're expensive. Mm -hmm. Good thing I have a lot of LP. <laughs> I have 200 grand of LP. Alright, so now I need to figure out where the fuck the deli bird stores are. Oh, uh, zoom in again, zoom in at. Okay, go to this, go to this. Okay, zoom in. Yeah, there we are. It's one of the bag icons. A uh, deli bird presence. There we go. Mm -hmm. Actually, okay, so fun fact. So, do you care about- Okay, this is a technical spoiler for one of the forms in your game, but it's only one. Do you care? Maybe. It, this is a yes or no question, because I'm about to spoil one form for you. Or will you? Well, I don't know if you know it or not, but, all right. So, do you care? Because there's a 50-50 that you may or may not know about it. Maybe. That is, not, that is a restaurant. Oh. Go oh, for Broke Grill. Uh, it should have a deli. It's red and it has a deli bird on it. 
I don't see that. Mm, you'll have to walk around a bit then. Or like, okay, go back on your map and look. No, that's that's my fault. Come on. Zoom in again. Zoom in. Bag. Keep going. Darn. There we are. There we are. Okay. Battle items. Miracle C, boost dollars, grass attack news. Okay, that could be good for Bramble Ghast. Of cash. And that's obviously. Mystic Water. Water type moves. That could be great for. N. It's the expert belt. I love the fact that you can buy focus bands in this game now. Because I remember, I'm pretty sure in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, to beat a uh, strategy to beat the final boss, uh, like Ultra Necrozma, was mm -hmm. to have a Pokemon with a, like a weak Pokemon with focus band, that new quick attack. Or I think it was retaliate and then have a Pokemon that new quick attack. But the only Pokemon that knew retali retaliate, I think, was Hula uh, Huanch. Fucking flying bird shit. Who want these? Ah, goddamn it! What the fuck is this motherfucker's name? Lot. Whatever. I hate his name. You know what? Since the Chonk has Earthquake and a lot of heavy hitting moves, I think Razor Claw would actually be good for him, for them, because it boosts the critical hit ratio. That would make them... Oh, Halucha. Halucha. Uh, Sorry. Halucha knew Retaliate. I think he was the only Pokemon that naturally learned Retaliate. Yeah. I think I just got everyone's items in one Fuck store. Yeah. Why are they all holding berries? Okay, so Focus Band. Wait. No, not use the item. Give the item to Gardevoir. Because they keep getting their ass kicked. <laughs> see, Miracle Seed, you will go to Brandle Gas. Oh, well, they're all holding berries because that those berries help them keep awake or remove confusion. So they're not that's, bad that's berries. Go to Gyarados. Pokemon, your you have increased power over fire. <laughs> and the trunk will have the ability to do critical hit ratios. So okay, so the other towns that have deli stores are Iano's, uh, the Ion, the city Iano is in, and the uh, water, water gym town. Well, I don't need any more items, so... Yeah. Well, we take on the team leader, because he said they were easy. Oh, I haven't fought, fought, fought the actual leader. I only fought the clavicle guy. Oh, well, we're about to see if they're easy. <laughs> I'm gonna guess no sense for that storyline. They are the final boss. Oh, they are? Well, I'm shit. Sure. Well... Well, if you go in the building, you're fine. You just have to go to the specific place. This is actually a good time for you to check the classes. That no. you never check. I don't want to check the classes. You get stuff for the classes! I don't care. Well, I'm actually standing right on top of it, Dragon. It's probably because it's daytime. Actually, you're supposed to go in the building. There's actually a uh, place. Okay, go go in the building. Okay. We're not telling me to check the damn classes. Okay, go... No, you won't. Go to the place where you would select a class. No, not that lady. Not that lady. The thing next door. That thing. Yeah. Go down. 
schoolyard. That's where it would be. Alright. We're about to see who the team boss is. Well, it's oh. daytime. Oh. Oh, oh god. <gasps> it is Penny! <laughs> Why did it turn night, though? Right. Aaron. Thanks for coming. 